So this little video is to help you understand how to embed images into your posts. Since we're graphic designers, I think it's a very good idea for all of us to begin the process of utilizing images when we do our discussion. It's a great way to support whatever part of our discussion we would like to support. And since we are graphic designers, one of the things that we have to begin to learn to deal with on every level and think about are visuals or images. So I, I'd like to encourage you to start using images, even if it's not mandated, just to look more professional. Now, many of you already know how to incorporate images into your posts, but some of you do not. I run into this every mod. There are students who don't really know how to discuss or how to um, embed images into their discussion posts. So this little video is just basically to give you an idea how that process works. So to get an image into your post, you're gonna go to your account and you're gonna go down to where it says files and you're gonna click files. And then you'll get into this uh, files dialog box and if you take a look up here, you'll see where it says upload. Now. You can place this pretty much anywhere that you want. I have a folder called My Files, and I'm simply going to place my uploaded file into My Files. So you, to do this, all you do is you click on Upload, and you get this dialog box, and I'm going to go to my desktop, because that's where my image is to be found. And I'm going to scroll down, and I have this image called American Waving Flag that I'm using for this example. So I choose that, I hit open, I get this, more, uh, this warning telling me that it, an item name waving American flag JPEG already exists in this location. Do you want to replace the file? I'm just going to replace this. You probably won't get this because you'll be putting your file up for the first time. The only reason I'm getting this is because of the files already in there and I'm replacing it to show you how to go about uh, getting the image in there. Okay, so just don't uh, expect to see this. This is because the image is already there and I'm replacing it. Yours should just go in. So I'm gonna hit replace. This is what you should really see. Okay, and then if you scroll down into your folder, which is my files, again, it's where I placed it. Waving American flag is right there. And if you take a look down towards the bottom here, you can see that I've got 75% of 26 point or 262.1 megabytes used. So that's even telling me how much space I have to upload files. And another thing is occasionally you can uh, get rid of some of these files. You know what I mean? These files don't have to be kept there, okay? In other words, you can come in here and you can come over here like this to this gear and you can delete the file. And you wanna delete this? Yes, see, and now it's gone. And what, it, what would happen is occasionally when you do this, get rid of these files, you'll free up space. So anyway, get back to the topic at hand, waving American flags in there, okay? So now I'm gonna go back to, I'm gonna go back to my post. Go back to my discussion. And I'm going to start a discussion, click here. I'm going to come down here and I'm going to hit reply to start a discussion. And then what I'm going to do is place my cursor in there. And of course, in your discussion, you know, you might have some copy there and you might be placing your image in the middle of, of a discussion. I'm just doing this as an example. So you hit the embed image button and you go to canvas and you go, of course, to my files. Remember, I told you I placed it in my files. So I click on my files and you can see right there, waving American flag JPEG. And you click that and then you scroll down and you update it. And there is your image embedded in your post. Very simple. You can also on the fly adjust the size of this. So you can make it smaller if you'd like to make it or you could keep it the size that you originally had it. After that, after you're all done, you post your reply and there it is, there's your reply, there's your image. Now again, this is just a demonstration, so there's nothing but an image there. And I just wanted to show you how to go about getting your image into your posts. So I hope it helps, thank you very much, and uh, see you in course.